Hey guys, it's time to Nefes and Show. In this video, I'm going to be talking about one of the new mythic items that have come about from the new antiquity system in the Elder Scrolls Online Greymore chapter, and why you'll be seeing it around a lot, particularly in PvP. The mythic item in question is Malakath's Band of Brutality. Outcast and I actually brought this mythic up during our discussion when we were reviewing the Greymore PTS patch notes, and we basically agreed saying that this mythic was going to be really BOP and no CP and uh, Battlegrounds PvP. What I don't think we expected was it being really, really powerful in CP PvP in Cyrodiil and Imperial City. There's three basic things you need to know about this item already. It's been banned by dueling yields in tournaments. Secondly, it buffs bleeds, proc sets, and siege weapon damage. Thirdly, due to the healing nerf, which is actually not just 10% through Battle Spirit, but mathematically 20%, Malakan's Band of Brutality is definitely much more noticeable, especially in 1v1 scenarios. It's so much pressure, so much sustained pressure, whether it's with the same sort of setup or with uh, Major Defile and things like that, you're basically either forced to deal more damage to force the person wearing this item on the defensive or be able to kite the person while dealing that pressure. These are pretty much do any counters basically to a build that will probably use this uh, item. We actually showcased using this item piece in our recent uh, Stamina Dragon Knight Bleed build showcase that Annie made. Uh, it seems really strange to talk about not critting in ESO because for both PvE and PvP in some shape or form it's always centered around crits. For PvP you have the impenetrable trait which is a counter to the critical damage other players deal to you, but Malakath's Band of Brutality simply ignores the impenetrable trait, upending an age old meta of building your survivability for PvP. The messed up thing about this is that most likely you're still going to be wearing Impen because not everybody will have Malakath or run in for their builds, but if you run into people who do with proc sets or bleed builds like the one I showcased, uh, then yeah, you're going to have a really, really hard time against the damage this puts out on you because Impen is basically useless. That's how messed up it is. That's 25% more base damage to everything. Light attacks, damage over time effects, procs, and skills. Will this item get nerfed? Probably. It seems a bit overtuned in my opinion, uh, even for a one-piece item, so that's supposed to fulfill the power fantasy of a five-piece item set, and I suspect that we're going to see a lot of players build around or against it. What do you guys think about the Malakath's Band of Brutality? Do you think it's too strong? Have you guys tried it out yet? Are you still farming for it? Will you be farming for it? Do you have any build ideas in mind for it? Let me know down in the comments below, and feel free to share what you think. As always, thanks for watching, and if you like the content I've been putting out for Harrowstorm and Greymore, please do consider subscribing to support the channel for future patches. Always appreciate it. Stay safe, have fun, and see you guys next time.